right, everyone. I wanted to provide just a quick five minute Zoom phone setup training. I know that um, you know there's a lot of options, a lot of features that Zoom phone has. So if you're just looking to do the, the basic essentials to get started with making calls and, and using um, your Zoom phone, then this is, this is um, going to help you get started doing that. So once you log into your Zoom account, you will see that you now have a Zoom phone tab here on the left-hand side. If you click that, there we go. This is what you will see the very first time that you set up your um, Zoom phone. It'll just ask for your country and area code um, and your, your time zone, just verify that that's all correct. And then you can set a pin code um, to listen to your voicemail if you would like to set that up. Once you've done all that, click set up. So one thing to keep in mind here is there are a lot of settings um, that's not, um, don't be overwhelmed by that because your admins have gone in and they have, your IT team has, has set up all of these um, ahead of time so that you don't have to. Um, the only one that you might want to set up um, is your, your personal emergency address. Like if you're working from home, you're working from the office and home, um, this just allows dispatchers to, to reach you more easily if um, in the case that you do need to, to make an emergency call. Next thing that I would recommend setting up is your business hours. Um, so, you know, you can see by default, mine are set up to eight to five. Um, yours may be something similar, um, but you can set those up if you want to adjust that, you know, to say um, nine to five, you can do that there. So within these business hours, this is how calls will be handled. Um, it will come through your Zoom phone appliance apps, which means um, your uh, any anywhere you have Zoom, um, Zoom phone available, um, your mobile app and your desktop app. So those may be different for you, but basically that just means it's ringing your Zoom app. Um, all of these are, are not essential. If you're just looking to get started, I said, like I said, quickly, um, you can set up a, um, a voicemail um, greeting. If you'd like to record that, I would rec recommend recording by um, computer. I'm gonna record a quick audio there um, just by clicking that record button and adding that there. Next, I would recommend setting up your closed hours. Um, so you can do that here. If you want to set up closed hours, that means if somebody calls you during those hours, you know, that's not nine to five or whatever your business hours are, um, you can choose that to go straight to voicemail um, or however you would like to, to, um, to handle that. You can also forward it to another user if you'd like. Last thing is setting up your holiday hours. So this would be, you know, we have, um, uh, you know, Labor Day or or something like that coming up, you can manage that here. Add a holiday, enter that holiday name, select the the date, and you are good to go. Um, you can edit that call handling there if you'd like. Um, you can choose that to ring all of your your Zoom apps. And that that holiday is set up. All right, so that is the the Zoom portal portion of the the training. Now that you've set that up, if you go into your Zoom client and click the phone tab, um, you're now ready to to place calls. So if I wanted to call um, uh, Paul, let's see if it pops up. I'm not sure who's in this directory. Okay, if I want to call my colleague um, Heather. I can just um, click to call her there. You can search uh, the name who, of who you're wanting to call, or if you know their extension, you can dial their extension here. Um, but that's the best way to place a call. You can see that here on the bottom, it shows your caller ID. So this will default to, um, to like your personal number. You can see right now it's defaulted to my main company number. I don't have my, my number set up yet. Um, 
you can uh, change these here, change these options here. This is especially helpful if you're a part of like a call queue or a shared line um, and you may not want to dial out from your personal line. You may want to dial out from your shared line. You can change those here and place calls there. All right, that's it. That's how you get started with Zoom phone. Hopefully that's helpful in um, getting you started quickly.